Temple a little trouble getting lined up with the right personnel on the first play of the game. Ely's going to throw. It'll take a short hop. Was it caught? And learned today, ESPN's Brett McMurphy reporting that has been denied. Batted in the air. Kareem Hunt on the spot and keeps it from falling. Here you see him getting in an empty set, which Temple kind of expected. And a little flinch by Storm Norton, the junior left tackle for the Rockets. Ball start. Uh, offense, number 74. Five-yard penalty. Still third down. There is a guy that's very electric, both in intercepting and making tackles for loss. Handed off to Mark Remy, who is smacked as he gets out to about the 25-yard. Careful backed up here. Ely throws out of the end zone. It's complete. First down yardage and more to the outside. Michael Ruff of their last game against Western Michigan. He can't play till the second half. Here's Kareem Hunt. Driving forward, surrounded by a pile of white jerseys. He'll get five tough yards. The mark of it four yards, so second and six. Ely loses the ball, and he'll take a big loss on the sack for the Rockets. Ely dumps it inside to Kareem Hunt. Hunt will get out to the 21-yard line before Matakevin for its first 10-win season since 2001. They start from the 25. Ely hands off to Kareem Hunt, who was the absolute star of Toledo's bowl appearance a year ago down in Mobile. Kareem Hunt again for Toledo. Pursued nicely inside. Getting off a block starting the second quarter with a third and long. Ely's throw off the mark. Not in early downs. Throws to the near side to Corey Jones, the team leader. He's not the big receiver on this team. That'd be Alonzo Russell sitting out until the third quarter. Ely with a nice back shoulder throw to the near side. Cody. Spot two. And now Terry Swanson tries to get a few tough yards up the middle. Not much going. Trying to juggle all these guys and fit them in is probably a chore. Here's Swanson driving forward, and he'll set up third down. Run some power, and this is a pretty good offensive line. They go quickly. Ely throws to the outside. Nicely caught there. Corey Jones still going. Into the end zone. He gets the pylon. Or do they say he stepped out? For the Rockets. Certainly have some bounce in their step, don't they? Here's Kareem Hunt. Trying to bounce off some of the Owl defenders, but he'll be stacked up with a fairly short... Throw it to Jones. Dives for the first down. The guys in midnight blue. Ely this time hits across the center. And a nice. Apologize for the difficulties with Tiffany's mic. It's been raining pretty hard at times tonight here. Doesn't always fit well with electronics. Is that picked off? Or did it hit the ground? They're waving incomplete. Go with the incomplete there. Too late now. If you were a Temple and you wanted to call the timeout, there's Kareem Hunt. Bounces off a couple. And the coach Candle, he really feels like he's in four down territory in these situations. There's Swanson. Gets a chunk of it. They need the 30 yard line. Ely throws through the hands of Deontay. And playoff semifinals. So Toledo back on offense and Swanson trying to grind out some yards. The ball have got a safety, and it seems like it's been all Toledo since. Cody Thompson on the reception. Was that a little deception on the floor? Ely steps up, but throws it through the arms of Corey Jones. Who I know, to I told about. him, I said, did your mom handle that? And he was, he was saying, no, I was going, what are you, what are you doing? <laughs> throws near side, and that'll be complete to Andrew Dick. Smart enough to get it all straightened out. Ely across the middle and a nice juggling catch brought in by Dion. Fast again, Toledo is here. Ely going to throw downfield and couldn't quite pull it in. Again, that was out in the direction of out here in this second quarter. He'll hand it off to Terry Swanson. And he'll be turned back, literally turned back. Ely swings it out with a lot of running room is Swanson, but tripped up and nice pursuit. So what can they do here with this last minute and ten? Ely throws to the outside. 
Nice juke. Deontay Johnson, and he'll get out of bounds. Full has been playing off, and you give up those hitches and underneath throws. Ely sidearms one out to Kareem Hunt, but he'll be sat on there and wrapped up nicely by Matt Ioannidis, who's out in coverage. For the field goal team, if you can. Ely across the middle, has his tight end, Michael Roberts, in stride, and he's down to the 20-yard line. Out at the 26-yard line. Again, no timeouts left for Toledo. They're going to hand it off to Kareem Hunt. He's not going to get much. See if they try and spike the ball to stop the clock and get the field goal unit on. In the lineup. Going to hand it off. And Kareem Hunt doesn't get much. Re really have a Jones who had the touchdown in the first half, so it makes it really tough. Somebody's got to get singled up out there. Kareem Hunt doesn't get far. Out here playing one high against the motion, but they have played a little bit more too high tilt on the pass game. Not on the same page? Absolutely. So from the 35, Philip Ely hands the ball off. Terry Swanson finds the going rough, as have all of the Toledo sides. Standing in the backfield, going to call it? <laughs> he stepped back. <laughs> nice run for Swanson. Close to first down yardage. And looks like he's still fighting forward in the middle of that pile. Terry Swanson, the sophomore from Alquippa, Pennsylvania. With a nice run for the run. The ball out just outside the 45-yard line. Give Swanson another go. He'll fall across mid. Have fun. Don't look at the score. Just enjoy the game. Swanson will get the first down there. Remember, these players on this. Did they just change centers there on the go? Damian Jones Moore with his first touch. of line by trade, so that's where he's keeping a lot of his eyes. Jones Moore again with the carry in just what is now a tropical deluge here. Really affects the passing game. Jones Moore fighting to hang on to that ball. Michael Dogby was the first one. Down. Gonna rush three. Matt Cavish looks like he's one of them. Ely throwing long. Got a receiver. Caught. Corey Jones. No, they say incomplete. It came out. But haven't had anything going through this uh, second half so far. He's going to try here. Down the field. Hits a receiver in stride. Cody Thompson. A race to the pylon. And a touchdown, Toledo. See Phil Snow when he does. Brings pressure. Nice catch reaching behind him for the ball. to The DN punching out in the corner on the backside. Now Kareem Hunt to try and eat a little clock. He'll have the first down. And about then it is a strategy with a clock. Healy throws. There's Russell again. Steps aside, gets first down yardage. Watch your run. I'm telling you, Philip Ely's putting on a show. That guy had a run pass option that last time, pulled it, throw the hitch outside. Toledo gets out of it. Now they change up, play more quarters. And again, Kareem Hunt protecting the ball when he's whacked there. But. into the center but Michael Roberts with some here's the reverse Corey Jones coming at you knocked out of bounds a tough momentum and a yardage play here's Terry Swanson bounces off a would-be tackler down to the 23 smoke coming out of his calculator Swanson like Ionitis and Medicare from the 20 down to the goal line. There's Hunt. Hit. Hit nicely by Stephon Marshall. Back to their seats. Who knew football could be such a workout? Nice pass. Alonzo Russell. They're going to mark him death for Toledo. Needed one to tie and two to take the record. He just missed one there. Philip Ely doing a nice job. You see him. Get at the free safety, got his coverage direct to touchdown rockets. Kareem Hunt into the end zone. What happened underneath all that? They don't stop it from the replay booth, so it's Toledo ball, and Kareem Hunt has it.
got time to stop him. An army crawl in there. That's exactly, we call it a dig out, and that was, that was where you have a dig out. Kareem Hunt digging inside the 20. Mago all the way to the end zone. And he does. Touchdown Toledo.